Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Salam khan here. And today with the topic of neither energy nor power signal. We've seen the energy signal separately. We've seen the power signal separately. But we have a class of signal that would neither satisfy the conditions for energy signals nor will it satisfy the condition for power signals. That class of signal is neither energy nor power signal. In shortcut, I will be writing it further in the next videos and whenever it's needed, I would be writing it in this short name NENP, neither energy nor power. Fine. Now, if the magnitude of a signal approaches infinity at any instant of time, I believe this won't be clear to you from the light. Instant of time this is, okay? So if the magnitude of a signal approaches infinity at any instant of time, which means only one, so that is neither energy nor power signal. That's it. That's it, okay? Or you can take a signal, you can do the calculations for energy signal. If the energy is finite, which means this is a, an energy signal, right? Similarly, if the power is finite, which means this is a power signal. Well, if the energy is not finite, the power is not finite. So what's that signal? That is not in neither energy nor power. But you can just guess it like this. If the, if the amplitude is approaching infinity at any instant, this is neither energy nor power signal. Fine. So if I, if I have an example for you guys is, let's say if, if I have a function x of t, which is equal to uh, t, let's say. So if you have a function which is y equal to x, so this would be the function. Isn't it so? So it is reaching infinity, negative infinity in the negative side and positive infinity at in the positive side. So which means it is reaching infinity at any particular instant. So this is neither energy nor power signal. Similarly, if you take, if you multiply it with u of t, which means if you have only this particular side of it, so this is again reaching infinity only at a single point, this is again neither energy nor power signal. Similarly, you multiply it with u of negative t, so you get only the negative side, and this side you don't get, so this is again neither energy nor power signal. Similarly, if you have exponential of t multiplied with u of t, which means if we are considering the right hand sides only, so this is an exponential rise and it's reaching infinity as time approaches infinity. So this is again neither energy nor power signal. You have 1 over t. x of t is equal to 1 over t. So how would that be? That is located in the first and the third quadrant. This is the thing. So have a look again. The magnitude is reaching infinite isn't it so this side also and this side also fine this is 1 over t similarly you can have other signal let's say a parabola let's say you have a parabola is t squared right a quadratic equation t squared so you have this sort of a wave so have a look this is approaching infinity Electric so, so these are neither energy nor power signals. Now a confusing point. I forgot to tell you in the previous video. Today I tell. So let's say the function is x of t which is equal to tangent of t. So the graph for tangent is like this. Somewhat. So this is pi by 2, this is 3 pi by 2, this is 5 pi by 2 and so on. So have a look, the magnitude is reaching infinity, tangent of t is approaching infinity at t equal to pi by 2, 3 pi by 2, 5 pi by 2 and so on. So which means that if it is reaching infinity at any particular point, so this means the tangent of t is a neither energy nor power signal. But also, we know that tangent of t is a periodic signal. And in the previous video, I told you that periodic signals are power signals. All periodic signals are power signals, but over here I am contradicting my point. 
So what does this mean? Well, in the previous video, I did not tell you the complete point. The complete point is that all periodic signals, wait, all periodic signals are power signals if and only if their magnitude does not reach infinity at any instant of time which means now this is not the case so in this case it is reaching infinity at a particular instant of time so this is uh, neither energy nor power signal this is not a power signal right so this is it for uh, this video I believe just a simple video just a short video just to tell you that if if the magnitude is reaching infinity at any particular point the signal is neither energy nor power in the next video we summarize neither energy nor we summarize the whole thing that we've discussed energy signal power and neither energy nor power and that would be the end of it so till then take care of yourselves and everyone around you goodbye